Hey guys, Dan here from V Hicks 411. Today in front of me, I have a Volkswagen Audi engine computer, and we will show you how the Emo Immobilizer Security Delete is done. Uh, not all Volkswagen or Audi engine computers Emo Delete can be done. So in this particular one, the ME 7.5. This one is one of the easy ones, so it's going to be a pretty quick video. I will show you how it's done. Now, there's other ECUs that will have a processor and an EEPROM, and you will have to read both of those with reading those already makes it complicated, and then programming the flash and the EEPROM also a little complicated. So, this is the easier one. I mean, this guy already tried replacing everything, including cluster, keys, had a locksmith try programming, so he gave up. The car's not worth the money he already spent on it, so we will show you how it's done. Now, I'll be using CarPro to read the EEPROM in it, and I will be using the Abritus software to crack the emo delete file and program it. So. Got it all ready, taken apart. Let's zoom in. And we have the 95040 EEPROM in this. I will set up my programmer to read it. Pin number one to plug number one. doesn't always want to hold, so I'll hold it over here. I already have my car probe set up to 95040, and we will read this file. All right, as you can see, I read the file. I will save it as 06 is an apple, 906 032. DL and this is going to be a ME 7.5 ECU 7.5 ECU and it's ammo on on this one so mobilizer is active all right so save my file that I read with the car probe I will go to my Abritus as you can see Volkswagen Audi Abritus I'm going to go to my dump tool I will find the ME 7 right here the ME 7 emo bypass software I will load my file that I just read which is over here 06 emo on load it over here and you can see emo is now on boom emo is off Already reprogramming it, and I'm gonna save my file as emo off on this one and save that. Really nice tool, the Vritas. This is the guy right here I'm talking about. Expensive, but it's really nice. So, emo is off. I will exit it out. I will load my emo off file. And we can confirm it. I can open up my EEPROM utilities. And what is this? The zero, I believe. Yeah, this is ammo on file right here. And then zero, ammo off. We can compare, as you can see. Boom, change something here. Same change stuff here. So it just changed a couple locations. And that's it. So th this is the easier one. Let me make sure ammo off. And I will just load the file back on here. Let me hold my EEPROM plug right, and hopefully right without taking the chip off. Nope. We're gonna have to remove, unsolder the chip, and program it. So, as you can see, doesn't always one up right. So, I'll just hit remove the EEPROM pretty quickly, doesn't take too long. Alright, got my 
heat going. Got my pin number one. got it removed I will as you can see it is it has some glue over here that they glue the chip on so it does take a little bit longer to on solder this EEPROM so you got to be really careful without melting anything else over there all right let me clean it up I will solder clean up my tracks the original ones that way they're nice and smooth before I install it meanwhile my EEPROM is cooling off okay as you can see it's nice and smooth by this time my EEPROM should be cooled off very important to read the file, original file, before removing that way, if it heats up, not corrupting the file. So let's clip it back on here. Click right. Okay, so we've written the file. Ammo is now delete on this particular ECU, we'll set it back straight. Let me zoom out that way. Easier to see. really important to make sure we have a good connection you gotta inspect it make sure it's nice not shorting anything out I will clean it up around it make sure pin number one is installed correctly as we can see pin number one and that is it so if you need the service done you don't have the programmer you don't have uh, the skills of removing and unsoldering and or the software to do it i mean if you do have a programmer we can sell the software like you can load up your file and we can do that but if you need this service done at the end of the video link or in the bottom otherwise if you like what you see hit like subscribe and i will see you in the next video thanks for watching